This development is put in four ton geothermal heat pump systems that do the air conditioning and heating. And we pipe the fluid um, out through these tubes into the four boreholes outside that are 200 feet deep. And that fluid comes back through the compressor, compression system, the heat pump. We extract the heat and we put it into the house. They run at about 350% efficiency. So for every unit of electricity that the owner buys, they're getting three and a half times that in usable energy. And that's why the systems, in the long term, the cost of operation is extremely low with them. And the unit, as I mentioned, can go backwards, so they get air conditioning as well. The units qualify for the federal tax credit, up to 30 percent, uh, no cap on them. Because they always get a steady temperature from the ground, and the ground temperature is an inexhaustible fuel source, uh, the units will last 20, 25 years uh, with minimal amount of maintenance, which is another feature that's uh, unique to geothermal heat pumps. Um, the ground loop itself, there's no maintenance required. Uh, it's a fluid and an antifreeze that is just circulated around and around. The tubing in the ground is all one piece, so there are no fittings to come loose, so there's nothing to worry about there. The system will adjust the heat output according to the load of the building. So the compressor can fire itself one stage, two stage, or it can bring on a third stage. The fan, because it's a, what's a DC or direct current motor, will ramp itself up or slow itself down according to the load of the building as well or for ventilation purposes. So the system uh, maximizes the amount of energy it uses to run uh, to provide really incredibly low cost. Typically, they cost more to install than a traditional heat pump system, but that payback period always comes up, and it's between seven and ten years, depending on fuel source, um, that that increase in cost uh, will pay. You'll get that back. It is the most um, efficient system you can put in now uh, to protect yourself against long-term uh, energy increases. So by 350% or three and a half times, for every unit of electricity you buy in the city of Seattle, that's like buying your, your fuel for two cents a kilowatt hour. It's an electric uh, unit. So uh, even as price increases come up in years ahead, you've really done a good job protecting yourself. So they're, they're quiet, they, they're very efficient, and they uh, pretty much take care of the whole indoor environment.